All right, welcome to Coffee with Marcus. This is episode 168. Today, I want to show you my trading routine, or I want to show you how I made a little bit over $26,000 in a month. So I'll show you exactly the strategies that I use, the tools that I use, and what exactly I do every morning to do this, because I'm not sitting in front of the screen all day long. All I do is in the morning for 30 minutes, maybe 45 minutes at most, I'm using my tool, the PowerX Optimizer, to find the best trades to take. And I want to show you today exactly how I'm going to do this. So let's get started. <clears throat> this show is about real money and real trades. I'll show you the trading strategies that I personally trade, the tools that I use to trade my own accounts, and we will talk about the right mindset of a trader. Now, talking about mindset, I'm going to show you how to create SRC profits. And SRC stands for systematic, repeatable, and consistent, because that is the key to long-term success in the market. So if you are sick of all the hype and empty promises, and you want to learn trading strategies that actually work, then Click on like right now and let's get started. All right, fantastic. So first things first, why you should you spend the next 30 minutes or so with me at all? Well, <laughs> first of all, I'm a real trader and uh, I'll be happy to show you my real account. So as you can see thus far uh, for this year, I've made uh, just shy of $85,000. And uh, this is only in five months. So if you break it down, that's around $17,000 a month. I think I ran the exact numbers and it was $16,969. Anyhow, so $17,000 a month covers my living expenses. So this means that I trade for a living. And if this is your goal, if you want to trade for a living, I want to show you today my trading routine and I will show you exactly what I do every single day. Now, um, let me just bring up a notepad here because in order to become a successful trader, I believe you need three things. The first thing is that you need to have a trading strategy. That is super important. And a trading strategy basically tells you three things. First of all, it tells you what to trade. It tells you when to enter. It tells you when to exit. That's also super important and we'll talk about this. And uh, that's in a nutshell what a trading strategy does. So you don't have to make it super complicated. Now, the second thing that I believe you need in order to become a successful trader is, oops, that's not what we wanted to do. There we go. Powerful tools. And I will show you the tools that I use in my trading today. And number three, you need to have the right mindset. And the right mindset is that you're not going for the windfall wins because uh, yeah, everybody can get lucky and make a lot of money on one trade. But you see, for me, it is important to generate SRC profits. And this stands for systematic, repeatable, and consistent. So having said this, I want to show you right now my exact trading routine and uh, what exactly I do, the strategies, the tools, my mindset, and uh, Let's just get started. So I personally trade two different strategies. The, the first strategy that you might know is the PowerX strategy. That is a trend following strategy. And you see, um, one of the problems that most people have with uh, trading stocks and options is overthinking. Happened to me. And uh, because the PowerX strategy is based on just three popular indicators, the MACD, the RSI, and Stochastics, it, it's hard to get too complicated. So the, the PowerX strategy is a simple yet powerful trend following strategy. And to outsmart the other traders, you need more than just a plan, you need an edge. And the PowerX strategy relies on time-tested methods that I have been using for the past uh, eight, nine, maybe 10 years, too many to keep track of. And uh, the second strategy that I like to trade is the wheel strategy. And the wheel strategy is perfect for a sideways market. So let me show you what exactly I do 
every single morning. This is where uh, we jump back on my iPad here and I have the tool that you might or might not know yet. Uh, it is the PowerX Optimizer. And uh, as you can see in this tool, I basically have two tabs for these two strategies, for the PowerX strategy and also for the wheel strategy. So uh, going back, if you just uh, think back for a moment, what I said, a trading strategy. So we need to know what to trade. And uh, right now I want to focus on the trading strategy, the Power X strategy. And in order to find what I trade, I am using a powerful scanner here. And this is what I do every morning. All I do is I click on run scanner. I select uh, a few criteria here. And the criteria that I use is that I like to take long trades only because I have experienced over the long run, long trades are outperforming short trades. I want to see at least a 40% return on investment. So I want to make at least 40% per year on my capital. And this is where we go back to these SRC profits, right? Because if I can make those systematically at a minimum 40%, uh, then I can grow any account, any any size. It doesn't really matter. Okay. Um, so anyhow, I'm also want to have a minimum winning percentage of forty percent. So I want to be right at least four out of ten times. I have uh, my my closing prizes that uh, are set between two uh, five and two hundred fifty dollars. Profit factor higher than uh, two and a minimum volume of five hundred thousand. Now, so all I do every morning is I click on scan and I do this at 8.15, 15 minutes before the markets open. Now, it, it will take a, a few seconds here until the scanner is done. Uh, usually takes around 20 to 30 seconds because now it is going through the database of, uh, I believe we have 12,000 12, stocks in the database here and uh, finds the one that uh, meet my criteria. And here's what I do next. As you can see, there's a list that came up here. Uh, I'm going to zoom in for a moment. So in the upper right hand corner, here are the scanner results. And the list consists of maybe two, four, six, eight, ten, maybe 12 stocks. And here's what I do now. Super easy, super simple, because as I said, most traders are making it way too complicated. All I do is that I bring up the stock and I look at this PL graph. And what does this mean? Well, it means that if I had traded this particular stock according to the rules of the Power X strategy, how much money would I have made and lost? And how exactly would I have made it? And as you can see, in the beginning, I would have lost money. Then I made a little bit. And then for the longest time, it's going flat. Then I made a lot of money and it is going flat. And you know what? This for me, does not look good. Here's what I'm looking for as I'm going through this list of stocks. I want to see an equity curve that looks like this, that goes from the lower left to the upper right. So therefore, AMC for me is not a stock that I want to trade. And I mean, no surprise there, it's one of the meme stocks. And if you have been trading these meme stocks and you're making a lot of money on this, good for you, good for you. Again, for me, it's more about the SRC profits systematic, repeatable, and consistent. And I do not like stocks that uh, provide me a windfall profit, but then for most of the time, it is not doing anything. So all I do right now is I click on the list here and I, I just say, remove it. So now I'm going to the next stock and this is CalX and CalX is already looking a little bit better. So all I do is go through the list and uh, do a, a yes, no, maybe. And for me, this stock here is a maybe because it does actually look pretty good. So I, I leave this in here as a maybe as I'm going through this list. And uh, now I'm going to the next one, DQ. And DQ looks okay. I mean, not bad at all. It's it's rather choppy here. It's going sideways, then it jumps up. Yeah, you, you get the idea. So compared to, to CalX, I, I would say this here is, uh, yeah, we can leave it as another maybe in here as I'm going through the list. So XP, as it comes up, uh, EXPI, uh, you will see that this is a stock that is definitely more uh, erratic here. And uh, again, this is where I'm just quickly going through the list, trying to find the best stocks to trade. And this usually takes me anywhere between five and 10 minutes here. 
So I can tell you for today, one of the stocks that I really liked was SPCE. So I entered SPCE and I want to show you some of the stocks that I'm in here right now. Uh, so let me just uh, refresh the screen really quick because earlier I saved a few more. So I am currently in, uh, in six different stocks. Let me just jump over here to my trading platform so that I can show you exactly which stocks I am currently in. So here we go. The six stocks that I'm in according to these rules are ARWR, CELH, PLUG, SPCE, SPWR, entered that today, and STAA. So these are the stocks that I have. And uh, they just came up on the scanner, so I can show it to you again. So this is where, uh, if you look at ARWR, this is a stock, I'm zooming in a little bit, that uh, popped up a few days ago. And you see, the entry signal was to go long at 73.96. And right now, it is pretty much hovering around there. I still have the green bars. But uh, yeah, this hasn't really taken off just yet, which is okay. Not every trade is a winner, keep in mind, right? Then I have uh, CELH, and CELH worked out really, really great. As you can see, I entered it here at uh, 5408, and uh, right now it is trading at 6403. So uh, this is actually a really good trade that is working out. And again, not every single trade works out. Here is plug, uh, that is another trade that I'm in. And also plug is just uh, piddling around here. SPCE, a trade that I entered yesterday, is actually doing really well. Again, going back here to my account, and this is here, I'm, I'm trading several accounts. Here with this one, I'm trading a rather small account of $20,000 because I wanna show you can trade it with the Parex strategy with a $5,000 account, a $10,000 account, $20,000 account, doesn't really matter. So let's just take a look at these six trades that I'm in right now. And we are looking here at the open PL. And I just want to add it up here really quick. So it would be $77.88 plus $340.50 plus or $183.70 plus $425.30. And you see it changes all the time $18.19. Uh, plus um, $428. And I believe I made a mistake by adding this. Of course, we need to subtract it. So minus 7788. And I'm subtracting it one more time. So I think that's a small mistake that I made in the beginning. So if I would right now sell all of my positions, these six positions, I would make $1,317. Now, based on a $20,000 account, this would mean 6.5%. 6.5% is not bad at all because if I can do that every month times 12, I would make, wow, 78%. And this fits my criteria of SRC profits. Now, not every trade is working out. As you can see, this ARWR is not really working out just yet, but I haven't received an exit signal. Now, let's talk about this. Um, because this is where I want to go back to what does a trading strategy do? Well, it tells you what to trade and this is where I'm running the scanner. Now, it also needs to tell me when to enter. And this is where today, uh, as you can see, SPWR is a trade that I entered today, just earlier this morning as I went through the list. And here you can clearly see that PowerX Optimizer tells me when to enter it is a buy to open uh, at 23.73. So here it do does not only tell me exactly when to enter, but also how many shares to trade. And now we are going back to the third thing that a trading strategy should do, and this is when to exit. So I also know exactly where to place my stop loss and where to place my profit target. And uh, this is what I put in the market as soon as I'm getting filled, because this way I can put the trade on, set it and forget it. Because I don't know about you, but throughout the day, I don't like to stare at the markets. I know that some traders are loving it. I love living my life. I love doing other things throughout the day. Like, for example, recording this video here for you. Anyhow, so this is 
what I do in a nutshell as I am going through the PowerX strategy uh, when I'm looking for trades according to the PowerX strategy. Now I want to show you what I do with the wheel strategy because I believe, uh, you see, if you just have a hammer, everything looks like a nail to you, right? You, you have heard this. So the PowerX strategy is a great trading strategy for a trending market. And uh, sometimes the market is just going sideways or even slightly going down. And this is when the wheel strategy is just perfect. And I'm sure that you have heard about the wheel strategy. You probably have read this book or gotten this book, or maybe you have seen some other videos. By the way, this book is available $4.95 on my website, rockwelltrading.com. Anyhow, that's not what I want to talk about today. So uh, let's just talk about what I do. So for me, uh, the markets open at 8.30 a.m. in my time zone. So at 8.15, that's when I'm usually looking for oops, PXS trades. There we go. So PXS, trades according to the power strategy. As soon as the markets open, now I'm shifting my focus to look for wheel trades. And I want to show you how exactly I'm doing this. So what I do is I click on the second tab, the wheel analyzer. And this is where, again, in the upper right hand corner, I do have a scanner. And right now, as I'm recording this video, not too many stocks are popping up on the scanner. There's only one stock right now popping up, which is NVAX. Usually the scanner is most active. <clears throat> um, yeah, the scanner is most active in the first 15 to 30 minutes. So between 8.30 and 9 o'clock. This is uh, 30 minutes after the market open. Again, for me, I'm in Austin, Texas. This is uh, central time. This is when I find the most opportunities here. <clears throat> um, okay, so let's see um, of how exactly I'm using this. So as a stock comes up, it tells me the best strike prices to sell. So I just click on the stock. Uh, it brings up a chart here. And as you can see, there's right now several strike prices where I could sell option. And again, right now, don't want to really go into the details of this strategy here. Uh, but I, I just want to, because I have other videos for this, I just want to show you what I do. Now, first of all, the key question is here that I need to ask myself when I'm trading this strategy. Do I want to own this stock. And uh, NVEX, looking at the chart here, I must say, no, I don't want to own the stock. This seems to be very erratic. If, if you look at the chart, it is going all over the place here, right? I mean, it, it, uh, this stock moves from around 120 here all the way up to 340, comes crashing down to 160, goes back up to 260, goes back down. For me, this is too erratic. So therefore, I would skip the trade. However, if I chose to trade this trade, to take this trade, I'm just saying yes, and I'm choosing a strike price that I like best. For example, here, the 125, the first column. Let me just uh, zoom in so that you see it, uh, because this is where I see the strike price, the premium, the expiration, how much it could drop in percent without me getting in trouble, how many days to expiration, and also my annualized RI. And I'm looking for at least 30% per year here. So when I click on the first one, it automatically adds it to the calculator where it now tells me exactly how many, um, how many uh, options I should trade based on my account size. And uh, here for this strategy, I'm using a $500,000 account. So this were eight options that I should trade tells me that I'm bringing in $816 um, within uh, what with, within the next few days. So that's $91 per day, including the weekends, which yields to a 33% uh, RI annualized. So I like this and all I need to do is right now switch over to my platform and uh, enter the trade. So as you can see this morning, uh, I found, for example, ABT. So this is here a trade that I took this morning. 
I'm also in LVS and I'm also in another trade, right? And as you can see, the calculator tells me exactly what to do because going back to what does a trading strategy do? A trading strategy tells you what to trade, when to enter and when to exit. And this is what I'm seeing here at a glance because for me, it is super important to take the guesswork out of trading. See, I, I went through this super quick, but right now, we spend 20 minutes together, maybe even less. Maybe it's only 14 minutes. And uh, during these 14 minutes, 15 minutes, who knows? <laughs> I've been able to show you how I place my trades because the biggest challenges for traders, the biggest challenge for me in the beginning of my trading career was what am I supposed to trade? When am I supposed to enter? And number three, when do I exit as I get in there? And uh, this is where this tool makes it super easy for me. So that's where we go back to what I said, the three pillars of a successful trader are, you need to have a powerful strategy, no doubt about that. And you need to have powerful tools. Honestly, I would not be able to do what I do. I would not be able to trade for a living without the tool because it would be too much work and it would be easy for me to get overwhelmed. Don't know about you, but in the beginning of my trading career, it was super easy for me to get overwhelmed. So this is where for me, it is important to have a tool that tells me exactly what to do in order to generate these SRC profits. So just to be clear, this tool is not to find the next GME GameStop that is going from, I don't know, $40 to $800 or something like this. That's not what this tool does. It shows me trades that I can take every single day. And that for me is the most important one, because as you can see with this tool, it is easy to really use my time in the most efficient way and only spend 30 minutes on my trading every day so that I can enjoy the rest of the day. Because you might actually still be busy. You might maybe have a job, maybe you love doing some sports or playing golf, or maybe you like chasing kids or grandkids, right? So your, your life is busy. You don't want to be a slave to your monitor all day long and neither do I. So this is why uh, I want to do this in a super efficient way as quickly as possible and then set it and forget it because the same as for the PowerX optimizer, I knew exactly when to take profits. I also have this here. So when should I exit the trades? It says it right here. So this is where super easy, what to trade, when to enter, when to exit. So this is the tool, uh, the PowerX optimizer that I use every day in my trading, and it is getting more powerful every week because uh, we're releasing new versions every week because I have new requirements. Sometimes I have great ideas where I say, you know what? And I would like to have this. As an example, right now, the next requirement that I have for the tool that my team is working on is as soon as I identify a trade, I just have a little button here and this button say place the trade. And this way it's automatically placed with my broker and I don't have to worry about this. You see, people always ask, is it possible to automate trading? I don't believe it is, but this is computer assisted trading. I said in the beginning, you don't need to be the smartest trader in the world. I'm not the smartest trader in the world. I'm not. All I need is I need to be better than a trader who is taking the other side of my trade. So, and with, with these days, lots of traders are entering the markets who don't know what they're doing. What do you think? Is this tool giving me an unfair edge in the markets? I believe it does. Do you think that for me, it is easier to make money with this tool than it is without the tool? <laughs> for sure. I don't even know if I could do what I'm doing right now without the tool. For sure, it would take me much, much longer. And I'm pretty sure that I would make more mistakes. Anyhow, so my trading routine is actually super easy, super simple. At 8.15 in the morning, 
I run the scanner and look for power X trades that I would then place at 8.30. This is when for me the markets open, so the markets are open. And then for the next 15 minutes from 8.30 until 8.45, I am looking for opportunities according to the wheel strategy. So love trading two strategies, super efficient, I guess. That is the German in me because yes, the accent that you're hearing, it is German. I came to the United States in Germany uh, from Germany in 2002 with a dream to become a professional trader. And in the beginning, it wasn't easy because I didn't have the right tools. I didn't have the right mindset, but that's a different story. And now it's working out. As you have seen right now, I'm generating on average $17,000 a month. My goal is to make at least $15,000 a month. It covers my living expenses. Your living expenses might be different. Your account size might be different. And this is why these two strategies are so powerful. Maybe your account size is not big enough for the wheel strategy. That is okay. In this case, trade the PowerX strategy, apply money management to build your account, to grow your account from a small one into a larger one. You see, the cool thing is it doesn't matter whether you like to trade stocks or options. See, this morning, instead of taking the SPWR stock, which I did, I could have traded options. I could have bought a call that expires in July, has 49 days to expiration. And as you can see, the tool is making it super easy for me to really pick the right trade, uh, pick the right uh, option here. Tells me how many contracts the strike price, how much should I pay on max, uh, as a maximum for this trade? And then all I need to do is place it on my platform. And again, in just a few weeks, we will have a little button here that says trade. And you push this button and then it will send it automatically to my broker, uh, my preferred broker here. And uh, I just have to confirm it because every broker asks you to confirm the trade. You know it when you place it. And this way it is done. Super easy, super simple. Okay, so I, I hope that this was helpful. And if you would like to get this software, uh, there's probably a link right underneath this video uh, where you can learn more about the software and get it into your hands. And here's the cool thing. You see, I don't want you to make a decision right now whether this software is for you or not. And this is why I'm giving you a 90 day money back guarantee. Yes, I want you to get the software now. I want you to try this software for the next 90 days. And if it doesn't dramatically improve your trading, if it doesn't generate winning trades for you, that you make back the investment in the software in a matter of weeks, then just let me know and I'll be happy to, to refund you the money because I want to make sure that this software is making you money. It is making me money. And this is what I've been showing you here in this video. And if you go to my YouTube channel, you will see that I'm regularly giving account updates about the trades that I do and how much money I make. So if this is something that you're interested in, there's probably a link right here uh, underneath this video or somewhere on this side or maybe above this video. Who knows where uh, we can place links or buttons and uh, just click on this one and uh, get this software today and start using it tomorrow. All right, now um, I appreciate you being here. So this is where I want to answer all of the questions that you might have around trading. So I see that there's a, a lot of uh, questions coming in here. Again, I hope that you're enjoying this. I know that many of you already have the software. Uh, if, if you already have the software, just type it in the chat or maybe leave a comment and let me know if this is helping you in your trading and if it's helped you to make money with trading. Because this is something that I struggled with in the beginning to make money with trading. I mean, in the beginning, I lost money. And uh, if the PowerX Optimizer or any of these strategies have helped you to make money, just let me know. Okay, so good to see everybody here. Um, oh my gosh, Jim, year to date, Jim is beating me by a few thousand dollars. I'm at $85,000. Jim is already at $90,000. Jim, is this a friendly competition? <laughs> so at some point we might have to settle it. And the one, uh, the one trader who made more money has to buy the other one a beer. 
or do we do it the other way around? Uh, that the loser buys the winner a beer. Anyhow, I'll be happy to buy you a beer or a beverage of your choice. As said, I'm German, so therefore I like my beers. But we can also have a coffee or tea. Okay. Good. Uh, Jason says, uh, what do you think about checking assigned positions to see if the PXO strategy has trigger prices for calls to buy? Now, I, I like to keep these completely separate. In fact, I'm even trading them in separate accounts because I do not like to mix and match it. It's a great idea, not for me personally, if it helps you, great. But uh, you see, these are two completely different strategies. The wheel strategy is rather short term. So for the next, uh, I want to say, two to eight days, why the PowerX strategy is more towards the next eight to 20 days. So different outlook here. Hey, William, so good to see you. First time to be live here. Okay, awesome. Good. Yeah, Jim is uh, is killing it with the wheel. Uh, Jason says, I'm only averaging $4,000 a month. Only, really? Trust me, there is traders watching this video right now who would kill for making $4,000 a month. Trust me on this one, Jason. You're doing good. You're doing good. Okay. Um, so is Marcus late? No, I'm just here. I'm here. Uh, so just hanging out with you. Perfect. Um, so any chance you get in touch with me somehow, uh, the best way is contact my team. I uh, Let's see. Let's see. Uh, contact the team and then we'll see if we can chat. Uh, just call or text 512-337-1885 or send an email to support at trading, uh, rockwelltrading.com. So uh, just let them know what, what do you need? How can we help? Okay. Anyhow. Good. So let's go back to, let's get rid of this. Teresa started with uh, $100,000, $200,000 with margin. Uh, added $56,000 in non-margin account much later. I know you're killing it as well. That's fantastic. Cool. So um, let's see what other questions do we have. Um, why did you select XP? Uh, Claire, I didn't. I, I ruled it out. This is where I said, you know what? Uh, no, that is not for me. So sorry for the misunderstanding. I ruled it out. Uh, the three that looked decent today, uh, just going back to the scanner, uh, were CALX, DQ, and uh, SP, uh, SPWR. And uh, again, based on what I saw, I decided to take the SPWR trade, mainly because I'm uh, already... Oops, that's not where I wanted to push. There we go. Uh, mainly because I already had five positions in my account. So I just wanted to add one. And this is why I decided on SPVR. Oh, well, look at this SPC that I added yesterday. That's doing pretty well. Can't complain here at all. Um, good, good, good. So uh, Josh, must have missed your update on your right position. Uh, you get out with a profit? Not yet, not yet. Uh, this is in a different account. Still working on this one. So still down on the right position. Uh, but I did take, uh, what did I take today? What did I say? Uh, ABT. ABT as a trade. And this was working out or is working out thus far really, really nicely. Okay. Uh, so right, still down because uh, would like, okay. Adam would like to see that account. Sure. We can take care of that for you. No problem. Uh, let me just switch it around. So logging into this account. There we go. Uh, Adam. This is this account. So ABT looked much better earlier. Right now, I don't know. Did it lose a ah, dollar? I have a strike price here of uh, 115. So this should be just fine expiring tomorrow. Uh, there's my LVS trade that's doing well on LVS. Uh, I made some some good money on LVS thus far this year. Yeah, look at this. I already made two thousand three hundred dollars, one thousand seven hundred unrealized. So it seems that uh, we are getting close to four thousand dollars here on uh, on LVS. And then, yes, right, I have it boxed in, but uh, still down. Made $11,000 today, but still overall down on this one. And if you look at all of the trades that I took, uh, so there's one losing trade thus far, but this only unrealized PL and unrealized PL changes all the time, as we know. I mean, today it changed by uh, a factor of what, 12,000 or something like this? It's just crazy. Okay, anyhow, uh, Adam, does this help? Cool. All right, Jennifer is asking how much uh, for the mastermind. Uh, just uh, text or call Lisa. 
different number, 512-858-8523, or send her an email at lisa at rockwelltrading.com, and uh, she'll talk to you to see whether it makes sense for you uh, or not, right? I mean, it's not a good fit for everybody, but uh, maybe it's a good fit for you, Jennifer. So just contact her. Okay, so Joseph, uh, currently the advice is not to take any short trades. Mark and I, mainly Mark, uh, tested this strategy over a little bit more than 700,000 trades, 700,000 trades. And uh, we found that long trades are outperforming short trades. So uh, this was tested back over the past two years. So it included the COVID drop and it also included the drop that we had in uh, 2019. So uh, there's two actually pretty big drops in there. And yet it seems that overall long trades have been outperforming the short ones. Okay. So uh, would you trade SPC and plug with the wheel option strategy? No, I would not. Again, Giacomo, two completely different strategies. This is why we have two different tabs. Don't mix and match. I don't mix and match. I mean, this is a absolute, uh, for me, it's a no-no. So for you, let's see what works best, but I recommend not doing it. Okay, um, AP Blue Boy uh, Mastermind. This is where I trade live uh, with my mastermind members in the morning. So this is where I'm usually spending a little bit longer in front of the computer. So I'm usually we trade uh, together for what? I want to say 45 minutes to 60 minutes. Lots of fun. Here's where you can get more information. AP Blue Boy, if you're interested in this. Okay, cool. My gosh, Peter made $21,000 thus far. I, I hope that you're happy and that you're making cartwheels, talking about wheels, right? Because this is awesome. I mean, really, there's so many, just the mere fact, Peter, that you are making money is amazing because you know, most traders lose money. It is said that 90% of traders lose 90% of their money in the first 90 days of trading. Well, that happened to me in the beginning. I don't know if this is true. It's, it's a rumor that is going around, but if you're making money, you're way ahead. Making $21,000, trust me, there's many traders who are watching this right now and say, I, I wish I would be like Peter. Trust me on this one. Anyhow, good. Uh, so for PXS, if there's a gapping down, do you take the trade or not? No, I want to make sure this is why I see my entry price and it needs to go through my entry price. So I like to place a stop order at my entry price. Based on the bid ask, sometimes I like to use a stop limit order, right? So I want to make sure that this trade really has momentum because the PowerX strategy is a trend following strategy. Okay, cool. Um, Joseph has have never been assigned a stock using the wheel. I've been using it from the beginning. You see, this is why it pays to be conservative with the wheel. If you're getting too greedy, it'll hurt you. You know, I told you the right trade I took the right trade when I was bored, when I was stuck in Florida. Uh, after my kids had a sailing regatta, uh, we were still in Florida uh, in my RV and we had this snow Magadan <laughs> hitting Austin. So I couldn't go back to Austin. It was too dangerous to drive. And uh, so I stayed in Florida, was bored and took the trade and uh, yeah, wasn't the best one. Anyhow, so uh, Lisa, how can I own the two programs that you use? I just use mainly the one. It's the PowerX Optimizer, but it is for both, um, for both strategies, the PowerX strategy and the wheel strategy. Lisa, I'll, I'll put it, or my team is probably putting a link in there right now because currently we are running a special. And what is included in this special, forgot to tell you, is that when you take advantage of this special right now, we will trade live together next Friday. Now, if you're an existing customer who already have has PowerX Optimizer, you're invited anyhow for free because that's my commitment to you. If you invested in the software and when you did it and uh, it was a really smart investment, I want to make sure that I over deliver. So next Friday, we'll send you an email. We are doing a class together. We will trade live probably for an hour, an hour and a half in the morning and we'll trade both the PowerX strategy and the wheel strategy. So you'll get an email and when you invest in the PowerX Optimizer right now, this uh, wheel masterclass will be part of this. Okay. So Timothy, uh, when do you exit uh, with the PowerX strategy on black bar or are they hitting a target? So I'm exiting three exits, either when I hit the profit target or when I hit the stop loss or number three, 
when I see a black bar, because a black bar means a change of direction here. Okay. Tyler is asking, can you talk about the time frames on your chart? Uh, I look only at daily charts. So that's a beautiful thing. I used to day trade a lot when I was younger. Now I'm 51 years old and I'm getting too old for day trading. That is uh, for the youngsters. I'll leave it to them. It's very nerve wracking. Um, made some good money day trading, but I must honestly say I'm making more money swing trading the way I'm trading now than I ever have with day trading. So this is why I'm, I like to trade uh, swing trade on daily charts. Tyler, is this helping? Okay. Good. J.R. Ewing, what was that saying? I don't need to be smart, just smarter than the trader on the other side. Right. Because uh, you know that trading is kind of a zero sum game, right? I mean, if, if you go long, you want to be right. Uh, so the stock needs to go up and somebody else is selling to you. So they have a different outlook. And as long as you're smarter than that trader, you're doing good. Good. So Adrian is asking direct placing uh, from PowerX worth with any brokers, interactive brokers or trade station. Um, the first round, in the first round, we will uh, implement the broker that uh, I will use going forward. Uh, go to rockwelltrading.com slash broker to find more out more about this. Or I did a video. I'll link to it in the description of why we chose this broker. And then um, as a second step, our plan is to integrate interactive brokers. So these will be in the first run, the first two brokers. Uh, we shall see. Okay. Good. Uh, let's see. Uh, Lynn, will the trade button go to any preferred broker? Again, uh, in the beginning, it will be the one that uh, I will have where I will have my accounts. Uh, it's, it's called Tradier. Again, if you go to rockwelltrading.com slash broker, there's more information. There's also a special deal or I'll link to a video where you can find out more. I'll, I'll keep you posted as we are getting closer to releasing this. Okay. Good. What else? Uh, so David says, will you be able to automatically make the wheel option trade from the calculator? Yes, David, that is the idea. Good to see you here. Good to see you. Okay. So uh, Sandra, I mean, Sandra, is, is this you who is in the mastermind? I know that you have invested in the software and now you're part of the mastermind group. So excited for you uh, to, to be here. And yes, it is awesome. Patty, good to see you here. That's amazing. There's Dion. Dion from uh, Switzerland, also part of the mastermind. You've been using uh, what the PowerX uh, uh, optimizer for a couple of years now. And I know that right now throughout the day, you're really busy with your new ventures. And uh, we haven't talked in a while. We need to catch up again. Anyhow, Edgar says, yeah, PowerX optimizer already paid for itself and it's making me money. That is good. That's exactly what it's supposed to do. So uh, crazy. Crazy Latino uh, is asking for options. What are, why are the DTE so far out? When you're buying options, when you're buying options, you need to avoid time decay. And time decay is kicking in in the last 30 days. This is when time is working against you. So as you go further out, you don't have the problem of time decay. So you want to make sure that this trade really pans out. So this is for the PowerX strategy. For the wheel strategy, you're using way shorter term options because here you're an option seller. And this is where you want to uh, you want to take advantage of time decay. But uh, Crazy Latino, is this helping? Good. Leonard, so good to see you. Fantastic. Claire, I know we, we have met. Claire and I met at the Money Show in uh, Florida. Uh, by the way, I will be speaking at the Money Show in uh, Orlando in June. So this is where I'll talk more about both strategies. Uh, the wheel strategy and the PowerX strategy. So I have uh, two talks there. Uh, if you are in Florida and if you happen to attend the Money Show in Orlando, just uh, look up the program, uh, come to any of these uh, presentations and say hi. Would love to meet you in person. Okay. Cool. Jim likes this bet. Win or lose. I can buy you a beer. All right. You buy me one, I buy you one. We got it. <laughs> okay. And he'll say, yep. It will be awesome to have a trade button. It is coming very, very soon. The team is already working on this, but as you can imagine, this is where we spent weeks and weeks testing this because we want to make sure that we are sending the right trades. Can you just imagine? So anyhow, less is more. Started using the software a month ago, started slow and building confidence, and you are up already $6,000. This is awesome. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. God, it's so good to see you here. Uh, fantastic software, must recommend for anyone. 
there's uh, Duncan Dave made $1,800 in one week trading the wheel. That is amazing. Congratulations. I'm loving it. Loving it. Don, so good to see you here. I know that you're very active in our private community. I see all your posts. Uh, trust me, here's the deal. Uh, for those of you who are in our private community, trust me, I'm reading every single post. I might not always respond to it because uh, then I would be really busy for hours every day. But I see how supportive this private community is. Uh, so everybody who is new to trading and, and joins and becomes a new member of the community, they are experienced traders who have been using it. I mean, you see the successes here who will be happy to help you out and show you the ropes. And uh, yeah, sometimes I'm jumping in and all I need to say is basically, hey, what these guys said because they already got it. <laughs> Anyhow, good, good, good. Todd, $6,500 per month. This is so good. Todd and I also go back uh, quite a while, right, Todd? When did we meet? Two or three years ago? It has been a while. Okay. Anyhow, um, so Clemens is asking, how long should you stay in a trade if my trade don't get to the target that the program will say? Until you see a black bar. Otherwise, stay in there. As long as you still see green bars and it's going up, hang in there. See, ARWR, for example, it's one of the trades that is not yet taking off. Let's just uh, go back to this uh, and let me, let me just show you here really quick. So you, you see ARWR is a trade that is not yet taking off, but all of the bars are still green. And sometimes, as you can see here, sometimes it takes a moment before it takes off. So as long as you don't see a black bar, just apply a profit target and apply your stop loss. And uh, if your stop loss and profit target is not hit, just hang in there. So uh, what was it? ARWR was one of the trades that have not been taking off yet. Uh, let me just take a look at the other one. I believe the other one that has not yet taken off yet is... Uh, no, everything else has taken off. Um, I can just show you here. So plug is another trade that I'm in. This has taken off. CLH, this has taken off, obviously. SPC taking off. Uh, STAA, uh, this is a trade that I'm in taking off. You see, most of the trades take off right away. Not every single trade will, though. Anyhow, good. Uh, so, James, does this help? Okay. Cool. Uh, Sama Sama. We, we also, uh, when, when did we meet first time? Wasn't it like a year back? Haven't you invested in the software like a year ago? And uh, on average, you're making $8,000. I believe that's per month. That is just amazing. There it is. Yeah. A month. Okay. Don also on target for at least 30% a year. That is amazing. Hey, there's MH. Yes. Uh, by the way, I'm spelled with a K. I'm German, Marcus with a K. So MH, Asset Management, thanks. Great strategies, glad that you're enjoying it. Oh my gosh, Tony has made over $90,000 since January. You're, you're like Jim, you're beating me. And they see this, nothing gives me greater joy uh, than, uh, yeah, seeing how you're making even more money than I do. That's fantastic, that is just awesome. Okay, now, uh, as you can see, if you don't have the software yet and you're seeing all the success stories, I believe it's time for you to invest this software. So we'll leave a link right underneath the video or on the left-hand side. And again, you don't have to decide now whether this is for you or not. Get the software, try it out, see how it helps you in your trading. And if it doesn't do everything that I tell you, if I'm not over-delivering uh, with the education, with the software, with the tips and tricks out of the community that you're getting, just let me know within 90 days. I'm, I'm that confident that this software will help you. That confident that I'm giving you a 90-day money-back guarantee. Really, just, just try it out. Try it out. If after 90 days you're not making money with it, I'll be happy to, to refund you every single cent of your investment. But I'm that confident that it will help you to make money, to take your trading to the next level. Or if you have been losing thus far, to turn your trading around because you have seen the success stories here. Success story after success story, how this software is helping other traders to make money. So invest in it right now, link in the description or underneath the video or here, somewhere on this side or on this side or on this side, who knows? Maybe we should place buttons all the way around. Anyhow, have a great rest of your day and I will see you very soon. Take care.